We've got some breaking news here for you on the aftermath. Jared Allen has been traded from the Bears wow. to the Carolina Panthers for conditional pick. Now, this comes as John Fox and Vic Fangio in, in introducing the 3-4 defense there, right, in Chicago. And so moving Jared Allen from a stand-up defensive end to a linebacker, is this more of a fit now in Carolina, 4-3 uh, defense there for the Panthers? What's this mean? I, uh, th this is very interesting because I was speaking to Ron Rivera last week, and he was talking about the right defensive end position opposite Charles Johnson. This is where Greg Hardy used to play. They are not getting the sack production there because Coney Ely, their yeah. second-round draft pick uh, last year out of Missouri, they feel he functions better reduced inside to defensive tackle, much like they did with Greg Hardy. So now that they're getting an edge rusher on that side, and it's not they're not going to say, Jared, you need to do this or that. They're just going to say go. Yeah, yeah. Okay, they saw those highlights of Matt Ryan right there throwing the ball to Julio Jones. Think how good this is for Jared. He oh, leaves an 0-3 team going nowhere, okay, right. that's just building, to a 3-0 and team that's won the division two years in a row and is going to get their middle linebacker back at some point. And he gets back to a spot as a 4-3 right defensive end, uh, a position that could get him into the Hall of Fame one day. And so and this is a great fit for Carolina. And for Chicago, look, it, he was a right defensive end trying to play outside linebacker. It just wasn't a good fit in a new defense by Vic Fangio. And right now, Luke Keekley is out. So that's one of their big guns. So what do you do? You go get more firepower. I know it's not the yeah. same position. I know they don't do the same things. They're not the same player. But you bring in a guy that is a sack artist. That is exactly what he does in this league, get to the quarterback. And, and props yeah. to Carolina for doing this because one thing about Dave Gettleman, that he's come with the general manager there. He's come under heat for not necessarily addressing some of the issues, like a wide receiver mm -hmm. the offensive line. Yeah. They say our bread is buttered on defense. Mm -hmm. Let's go out and get a guy yeah. who might be able to get us. Let's go get a alarm. guy that can get after Matt Ryan in week 14. And who's a, right? and who's a class veteran. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's another thing. you got so many classy guys, guys like Thomas Davis. Mm -hmm. And Luke Keekley and Charles Johnson on that defense. That's a good fit. Well, that's a perfect fit for what they have. Well, and it's also a real need. In addition to Greg Hardy being in Dallas, Charles Johnson's out with a hamstring injury right, right, right. now. So, yeah, maybe, you know, maybe they get something out of Jared Allen immediately here.